Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this nice query problem? From what we have here, we can rewrite this as square root of 12 times 9 then plus square root of here we have 9 times 9 then divided by also in the denominator we have square root of 12 times 9 then minus square root of also 9 times 9 then from here we can separate this when we follow this law where we have root a times t here we can separate this as root a times root b that is what we have here then become square root of 12 times here we have root 9 now then plus here as well we separate as root 9 times root 9 then also in the denominator we have divided by root 12 times root 9 then minus also root 9 times root 9 and from what we have here root 9 here is common and when we factor it out we have root 9 into bracket here we have root 12 left then plus here we have root 9 left then close bracket divided by also here we have root 9 common so we have root 9 into bracket root 12 also minus root 9 then here root 9 we cancel each other here then we are left with root 12 plus here root 9 then over here we have root 12 minus root 9 and here we can write this root 12 can be written as root 4 times 3 then plus here we have root 9 written as 3 then divided by here as well we have root 4 times 3 then minus here 3 also following this law of sort here we can separate from what we have here we can separate this and this give us root 4 times root 3 then plus 3 here then over also here we have root 4 times root 3 minus 3 then from here this becomes 2 root 3 then plus 3 divided by also we have 2 root 3 minus 3 then from here we can rationalize this sort here and multiply with the conjugate of the denominator here we multiply the numerator by 2 root 3 plus 3 and also same thing here we multiply by also 2 root 3 plus 3 here then from what we have up here we have this can be written as 2 root 3 plus 3 or square because here when we have a times a this same thing as a square then divided by what we have in the denominator here follows from when we have a minus b then into bracket a plus b and which becomes a square minus b square from perfect square then here a standing as 2 root 3 so we have 2 root 3 all squared then minus 3 squared and here the expansion up here follows from 
a plus b o square will give us a square plus b square plus 2ab. Now when we apply this here to so what we have, here we have a square that's 2 root 3 o square then plus 3 square then plus 2 times 2 root 3 times 3 then divided by what we have in the denominator here the square we affect 2 that will be 4 then also the square affect root 3 that means square cancel square roots we have 23 left then my you know, 3 square here that's 3 times 3 which is 9 then also same thing up here we have these two affect 2 here that's 4 and times also affect root 3 that's square cancel square root that's 3 then plus 3 square here that's 9 then plus we have 2 times 3 2 times 2 times 3 that's giving us 12 root 3 there then divided by here yeah, we already have this as 12 minus 9 and when we simplify further here we have 4 times 3 that's 12 plus 9 then plus 12 root 3 over here 12 minus 9 give us 3 and here this give us when we sum this we have 21 plus 12 root 3 then over 3 and from here 3 is common from what we have up here then we factor it out we have 3 into bracket here 7 left then plus here 4 left 4 root 3 left here then close bracket over 3 and from here 3 cancel out and this gives us 7 plus 4 root 3 so here we have the solution to this given problem so here what we have here is same thing as 7 plus 4 root 3 thank you for watching don't forget if steps subscribe to my channel and turn the notification bell on share this video give a thumbs up and also put your comments in the comment section see you next class and bye for now